I'm here in the Careers and Humanitarians event day to share my experience with students and fellow panelists about my experience working in the humanitarian sector, mainly in the UN, in Honduras, Colombia, and Peru, and also to hear about expectation and experience from other students and panelists. So I've come to the careers event today. This is my, it's my first year of studying at the Institute and I thought it was a great opportunity to hear from people that are working in the field and are very knowledgeable um, and experienced and hear what their experiences are and kind of what advice they can give me as someone at the very, very start of my education and career. I decided to take part based on my own experience as an undergraduate 10 years ago. There weren't many um, provisions in place to provide support for undergraduates and as someone who's working in this field myself, quite often I could, you could feel lost. So my motivation is actually based on my own experience of wanting to actually assist those students who are interested in developing a field in the humanitarian sector. My role at Save the Children is really a galvanising role. My job is to bring attention to the latest crises, wherever they may be in the world, and to mobilise action, whether that's fundraising or political action, or just awareness of the public of the next thing we need to work on to save kids. The event so far has been brilliant. We've heard from some real leaders in the field, inspirational people, I must say, and that chance to really hear some personal insights um, that you're never going to get from reading kind of academic papers on websites, you're, you're never going to get. The event so far today has been fantastic. I've just finished my panel. There's a huge amount of curiosity, there's a huge amount of thinking, really challenging questions, really pertinent questions. People asking the right things at the right time. Students asking about what's happening in Ukraine. Listening to David speak from the front line in Nipro. Um, what could be better for students than that access to that kind of direct information about what's going on out there? It's been fantastic. I took up roles and assignments in Afghanistan and in South Sudan as a health manager, a vaccination campaign medical doctor, a medical emergency response team medical officer, and um, such roles. I am basically at the uh, Careers in Humanitarianism event today to share my experiences. I think that um, a lot of students and a lot of recent graduates will be able to benefit from my lived experiences from the assignments that I've taken up in humanitarian programming and that's what I'm here to share today. We've heard from students who have gone and done different experiences, but then we've also heard from guest speakers from Save the Children and UK Med. It's been really interesting to see different perspectives of people who've been in the humanitarian sector for years, some people who've just got a little bit of experience and lots of different areas because it's such a broad and vast sector. I think it's really interesting to see everyone's different experiences. It's been really good, I've enjoyed it.